channel i'm chloe and today i have got a huge primark haul for you so i went shopping to the world's largest primark in birmingham and let me show you what i got i got two mahoosive bags plus i've just remembered there's something else as well so this is a bag full of things for me and this is a bag full of things for jesse so I'm just going to start off with the things for me that way if you're only here for that then you can just watch that now and then i'll move on to kids later on so that if you're not into that then you can just turn off then so here is everything that i picked up for myself from the world's biggest primark let's go so i think i'm gonna put down here to start with and then i'll pull it all out so actually the first thing is something i'm wearing so i did go shopping what day are we on today it is it's wednesday today and we went shopping on saturday and i've already worn a couple of things already but the first thing is this gorgeous jumper this is so soft it's got a lovely collar and it's actually quite a long length one with a slit in the side and i just think this looks way more like h m or zyra zyra zara it is just super soft and i did like i said just take the tag off this morning but I think this one was £16 and this is in a size extra small, which is a size I usually buy in Primark and yeah, just absolutely lovely, so cosy, so nice. Primark have outdone themselves on knitwear this year, which brings me on to my next product, next product, next item, next piece. Again, one I've already worn, a plain, I cannot find the word for this, cream jumper and it's like one of these faux roll neck style and then a bit of a bat wing sleeve. Oh my gosh, I'll put this in here, but I can just see it's actually filthy. It's got like makeup around the neck, something on the arm, which is probably something Jesse ate or, you know, something like that. But this is just absolutely gorgeous. Plain, like I say. Yeah, it's a little bit like cropped. I'm just watching Jesse and Lee. They're just walking down. They're going to watch some diggers. I can just see them now. So yeah, and I actually just got this in a small because I thought the fit of that would look nice and that was £12 and like I said I did wear that the other day with these and these are a suede four legging tregging style with like a seam detail down the front and I was umming and ahhing over whether I got this pair or like the beige pair but I went shopping with Lee's mum and she said this colour and I was swaying towards this colour so I picked up this colour and this is in the size eight how much were these i don't remember i feel like these were 12 pound too yeah something around there these are in a size eight and these fit really nicely i probably could have got away with the six as well i was looking for the six but they didn't have any so i thought we'll go with an eight and yeah i could have got away with both just depending on what kind of fit and they've got a zip up the side and i've just noticed they do have like the zip detail up the legs as well so you can wear them a little bit like flared open if you're into that kind of look and the high waisted and like i say with that jumper they're just spot on the next thing i've got in here is this one piece unitard and this was 14 pound and this is from the i don't know how you say that it's from this collection so yeah it's from this collection and like you can see it was 14 pounds so yeah when we were in florida i went into lululemon and i tried on like a one piece and i just loved it but it was a little bit too big so i got this in the size extra small which is six to eight i'm yet to try it on but i hope it does fit and i just thought you could wear this so many different ways so it's very stretchy it's like a loungewear, athletic wear kind of thing, but I just thought you could wear this in so many different ways. I thought it'd be perfect for days when I'm just in the house, or me and Jesse have got like, he goes to gymnastics now, so one of his little classes. You can wear this, but you can also really dress it up. So I'm comfy, I can run around doing things, but I compare it with like my Ugg boots and an oversized coat and scarf and look really cool and trendy, but yeah still comfy and it's got some gorgeous detailing on the back as well then on the bottoms of the legs it feels a little bit weird filming this video i'm not gonna lie because i've not filmed many hauls in a long long time especially for my clothes so i feel like i've forgotten what to say half of the time so forgive me if it feels like a little bit rushed but yeah i'm struggling on what else to say but here's just what i bought from primark probably good that i'm not speaking too long about each thing because there's a lot next up is a couple of underwear sets by the way none of this is in any order it's just how it is in the bag so i got this lemon underwear set and i got this in the size small and it's 
like a thong set with a bra and it says six pound but I, I looked on the receipt and it was actually three pounds and then it's like a i'd call this like a crop top so because i'm still feed oh that's good it's strapless too because i'm still feeding jesse well not even just because of that but since having jesse i'm not a fan of like the underwired bras i much prefer like a bandeau or a bralette something along those lines i find them way comfier so yeah i picked up this set matching three pounds cannot go wrong and then i also got this in this gorgeous cobalt blue color and this was eight pounds and it's got the little bralette but then this is like cycle shorts so you could definitely in the summer if you're one of those girls wear this with like a blazer over it and some trainers that would look really cool for me i would probably wear the bra as underwear but then this shorts as cycle shorts but it's a nice set to do that with so i could wear that like this with a big chunky oversized jumper on for when me and jesse are just playing in the house all day so yeah again i got this in a size small rather than an extra small because it's underwear didn't want it to be like too tight you don't want you anything to dig in and give you extra flesh hanging over to you so yeah pick that one up too next is another knitwear item oh i'm going to show this then with some other pieces that i picked up so for the longest time i've been after just um a cream roll neck so i got this one and it's ribbed and like i said this is just what i've been after got it in a small because i didn't have an extra small but again small will work just absolutely fine and i think this was eight pounds yeah this one was eight pounds cannot go wrong they had loads of different colors i was actually choosing whether i wanted to do this with like the real roll neck or those one that had a fake roll neck and i've got lots of the fake roll neck ones so i thought i'd just go for the actual one just for a little bit of variety in my life one outfit that i had in mind for that is this next one so this is a two-piece outfit and this is gonna be my christmas day outfit i think I'd already seen this online before I went and I just think it's amazing. So it's this pink and red. I don't know if it is boucle or it's faux boucle, but it's shorts. I got these in a size eight and the shorts were 13 pound. We've got a gorgeous fake pocket detail on the front. And then to go with it is this cropped blazer jacket. How amazing is that gonna look again this is in a size 8 and the jacket was 20 pounds so it was a little bit pricier but again for 33 pounds is that for the set is this 13 that's it yeah 33 pound for the set that is way better than anything you're gonna pay in like Zara for a set like this so yeah uber excited to wear my Christmas day outfit was looking for a size 6 in the shorts but I'm hoping that the 8 will fit because my skirts that I previously bought from Primark in a size 8 and they now fit me really well so hoping they're going to be really nice also I'm sorry that this isn't a try on I kind of did plan on doing it as a try on but then just right now I just didn't really feel like it I'll be completely honest I didn't fancy changing my outfit loads thought that Lee and Jesse are going out but then we're actually all heading out this afternoon and I didn't want to take up that extra time I thought I'd rather have the family time so I hope you don't mind that and I hope you still enjoy my Primark hauls like this the next thing is a top again it's one of these ribbed tops and they got this in an extra small this time and this was eight pounds a black and white stripes now i hate stripes on camera they always look so bad but since i don't really vlog my day-to-day -day life every single day anymore i thought it was fine i used to literally lee had a stripy top and i used to tell him not to wear it because when i used to like daily and weekly vlog it just used to play heck with the camera and my eyesight and it was awful but yeah i picked up a stripy top and this one's just a plain long sleeve top but it's got some cool detailing down it so it's got like an exposed seam down the front and yeah again what i'm trying to go for with my outfits is comfy casual pieces that you can dress up because day to day me and jesse just roam around the house have lots of fun like i say we go to different activities so i need to be comfortable i want to be nice and cozy and warm at this time of year but i also really want to look stylish i've really got into well i just love autumn and winter fashion anyway but i feel like this year i'm really back into it so like the last couple of years when i just had jesse obviously it was hard to know what to wear and dress for my new size and things like that and then i was into it last year but i just feel like this year i'm more back to like 100 percent chloe do you know what i mean so yeah just really excited by the autumn and winter fashion that being said i picked up this sweater vest now it's a cardigan slash sweater vest and it looks really bulky and boxy 
but this is in a 2xs so again sometimes you've just got to look at how you think a piece will fit in primark rather than the actual size and this one was 14 pounds and i thought this would just look really nice with a little skirt like kind of like tucked in at the front so love that i love a sweater vest moment and keeping on that same theme i got two things that are the same in different colors you've probably seen these all over instagram i had and i went with it in mind for this one which is the beige version it's one of these sweater vests with the zip up the front but it's completely open at the side so you can wear this over anything really but i thought it'd look gorgeous and it is a little cropped as well over a white shirt so this is it's all one size as well which is really cool and it was six pounds like how much of a bargain is that so i got it in the black as well lee's mum was like oh they're both really nice well she actually saw the black first and i said oh i've seen it in the beige as well she's like well just get both it's six pound so i did and then there's one more thing for me in here and it is these i don't know whether these are gray or a top but i'm just going to call them a gray top and these leather shorts so if you saw my last primark haul you will see that i picked up these in black and i've just been wearing them quite a lot actually so i picked them up again in a size a and they were 10 pounds but i just thought i'm wearing the black so much that this color will be really nice for me too so that's everything that i got for me i'm going to put those back in the bag and then we'll move on to jesse's bits oh man i just broke that bag oh that's not going to be pretty in the thumbnail now is it right so now let's move on to everything i got for jesse now not gonna lie again i went a little bit crazy but jesse actually got some money and some vouchers for his birthday so i took that and spent that to get him like a whole new autumn winter wardrobe basically so the first thing that i picked him up is in it's from the so some things were from the baby section some things were from the kid younger kids section so this is the 24 to 36 months which tells me it's from the baby section but that's like equivalent to the two to three sizing and it's this mint oh yeah mint sage corded shirt how gorgeous is this and he could wear this as a shirt or he could wear it as a jacket so it's a bit of a shacket and like i say this was six pounds then i got him two seasonal outfits so i got him this set which is obviously a pumpkin jumper and jogger set and the set again it's in the baby section 24 to 36 months the set was nine pounds and we are going pumpkin picking so i thought he could probably wear that for pumpkin picking and then we are going to actually take him trick-or-treating this year as well so i thought he could wear that or he could wear this and this i actually they didn't have a two to three so i got it in three to four which is why i got them both because i thought if he doesn't want to wear this he can wear this next year as well this was 12 pounds how adorable is this it says boo on the hood it's a little fluffy ghost -ness. it's like a gilet outfit i don't even know what you would call this but basically you can just pop it on over his own clothes and you're good to go so that'll keep him nice and cozy warm hopefully i can get him to wear that for trick-or-treating but if not he's got his pim pumpkin pumpkin picking outfit too then i got him a christmas long sleeve top and i didn't know whether to get him this because my mum said that she'd seen him a really nice long sleeved christmas top but i picked it up anyway because it was only two pound thirty and then if she wants to get him the other long sleeve top then that's fine you can have more than one so this is a long sleeve top oh and this is two to three years this is in the younger kids section and it's just got loads of little fun different christmas bits on it like it's got gingerbread man and dinosaurs not but he's dressed up like santa you know it says cool yule christmas girls things like that just a little bit different to like a christmas jumper something nice and festive then some basics i picked him up some joggers these are 24 to 36 months and these were three pounds these are a white with it's like a really deep gray and i just knew that he needed some new joggers so i know white doesn't seem very practical but he had some in this kind of stripe when he was a little baby and it just threw me back and i really liked him so i got those and i also got him what i went looking for was some plain black ones two to three and these were 350 plain back joggers can't go wrong for playing out 
And then I also picked him up this grey camo pair. And these were 4 50 a little bit more expensive because they were print. But yeah, so those will be really good for going and playing in the park or hunting diggers like they've gone to do right now. Next up, I'm going to call this a loungewear set. So this was in the baby pj section so this is a 24 to 36 months and this was eight pound it's disney primark so it's a spaceman mickey waffle set and i say i'm gonna call it loungewear because it was in the pj section but oh my gosh i didn't even realize how big those pants look maybe it's gonna be pj but yeah i just thought this would be really nice loungewear you could wear it as pjs he could no, it still is probably loungewear. He could literally wear this just chilling around the house with us. Or you could wear it as pyjamas. Basically what I'm saying is multiple different uses for this. I thought it was really cute. He'll love that it's Spaceman Mickey. When I first walked it, you'll see the theme now. It's, it's very Disney related. I'm very sorry if you do not like Disney, but we do. And when I got out of the lift, because I, um, Lee's mum was already there, so I rung her to see where she was. And she said they're on the top floor, which is where, like, the Disney section and everything is. So I was like, okay. And as soon as I got there, I saw all this Disney stuff and I went a little bit mental, put it in a basket straight away. So I've got him this. This is one of these, I don't know, do you call it, like, a puddle suit still? It's like an all-in-one zip-up with Mickey and Donald on it. But basically, it's like a waterproof suit so that he can go splashing in the puddles like he loves doing and this is in the 24 to 36 months and it was 15 pounds so it was a little bit pricier but i figured like i say he loves splashing in puddles so just to be able to throw that on over his clothes and we're going out for a nice autumn walk or play would be ideal and then is this the last thing yeah this is the last thing and look at this this is a little mickey mouse coat how cute obviously it's got the ears on the hood i just thought this was gorgeous and it's all like fleecy lines on the inside this was 14 pounds and again it's the baby section because it was 24 to 36 months but yeah i just thought this was very jesse and he will love wearing that and wow that is everything i picked up oh no one more thing let me go show you that so for christmas we got jesse this mickey mouse coloring in house so it's one of these like playhouse, but you colour it all in yourself. So he loves colouring. Obviously he loves Mickey and Minnie. These are all the different designs that you can, that are on the different sides, if it'll focus, yep. That we can colour in. So he will love doing that at Christmas time. And that was £12. So I think that is going to be £12 well spent. Obviously it was really funny then carrying that around the rest of the shop for the rest of the trip. And that is everything now that I did pick up from Primark. So the total, I didn't tell Lee. But the total came to £257. Oh. But I did notice she charged me for one of my items twice. So one of the £14 items I got charged twice for. So minus £14, I'm going to go back to Primark with the receipt. And I don't know what they can do. But I'm just going to say, look, I wouldn't have purchased the same thing twice in the same size. So I don't know if they will be able to do anything. Or they might be able to give me a credit note for that. Because obviously I just bought it once. But yeah, that was my Mahoosive haul. We spent up, but... We've got a lot of nice autumn winter things now for us both. Like I say, Jesse did have a lot of birthday money and vouchers for all of his bits. So yeah, really pleased with everything I got and I loved going to the big Primark again. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you love seeing my hauls. Let me know also in the comments down below what other videos you'd like to see on my channel. So obviously I've got the Disney vlog still uploading in between all these other videos as well. But let me know in the comments down below what you want to see from me. Whether that's hauls, whether it's day in the life vlogs, whether it's a seasonal video such as something for Halloween or Christmas. Just comment down below and let me know. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye!